Hi guys, welcome. day today and that is exactly where I will be um, by the end of the day I love my bathroom I think it is a place for me to be able to become refreshed and renewed not only just by taking a shower or taking a bath but when I do my skincare routine I'm able to relax and have a moment of self-care and reflection of my day or preparation for my day in the mornings and so it's been super fun to be able to kind of create a collection of all of my staples that I have in my bathroom. Um, and I'm excited to be able to share them with you today. So um, let's first start off kind of with just the aesthetic of everything. Um, I love neutral colors. That has kind of been my thing since probably like freshman year of high school. I just love my neutrals. And um, I really wanted to kind of take my bathroom and create that kind of um, a vibe as well in there. And so um, a couple of things that I like to use just to start, just to kind of set the tone of the bathroom. I love having my little Palo Santo. I actually got these from Milk and Honey when, um, when they had sent me a couple products when I had ordered them. And so I got a little bundle of the Palo Santo sticks. And then I also have this little kind of, um, it's like a glass ref or a reflective um, little tray. And I'll put a lot of my beauty products, all of the favorite things that I use on here and I'll set it on my vanity. This is a really nice way just to be able to show off all of the beautiful products that you spend money on and that you use every day. It's easy and it's, it's accessible, but then it also is just a nice little aesthetic. So um, I always love adding that. And then on top of kind of adding to the aesthetic, I use these products. So I'm going to start off first with uh, my favorite serum. And this is the serum that I have um, on my little, my vanity in my bathroom. I love looking at it, love um, using it especially, but it is Nancy's Blend by Surcell. And so um, this is an incredible, incredible product. So it's a face oil and it is very much a botanical face oil. So if you're not somebody who really likes all of the flowery kinds of, of scents, um, those botanical scents, maybe this isn't for you, but this has been a game changer for me and my skin. Um, it is for sensitive skin and it has chamomile and lavender and gargonian, which is a very rare thing that you find in skincare. And I think that it's been really cool to see it kind of pop up a little bit more. It is really great for inflammation and for um, kind of evening out your skin tone. And um, I usually take like a dropper full and I'll apply it to my face and my neck and then I'll use like an ice roller or I'll use a gua sha or even like a solo wave, which is kind of like a red light therapy. I'll use that and um, this has been a huge staple. And so I will add that to my little my little tray right here and it goes right here. It's a beautiful little addition. Um, the, the products, I mean, the ingredients in here are incredible. So we've got um, like sunflower seed oil, apricot, jojoba, meadow foam. We have um, some rice bran extract, which if you guys have seen on TikTok, the um, rice trend where you basically you like boil some rice and then you rinse the rice and put it in um, like a little bowl and 
Um, then you're able to kind of put it in your hair after you shampoo and it makes your hair nice and shiny and smooth. It's supposed to really help with like bonding your hair follicles. And so rice is kind of a miracle uh, product when it comes to to skincare and hair care. So that's a very cool little fact um, if you haven't seen it on TikTok yet. <laughs> but, um, and then it's got lavender and chamomile and geranium. And so there are a lot of incredible um, botanical ingredients in here. And they, I think the thing that they pride themselves in is um, that Surcell is very much for it's plant-based, but then it's also science-based. So they take the incredible things that we have on our earth, the incredible plants, the incredible botanical um, benefits that they have, and they formulate it into awesome, awesome products. So this is usually $165 and with the live stream deal, it's $140 and 25 cents. So um, if you are in the mood to treat yourself to something that is going to last, I mean, I probably, I've used it for about three months now and this is all that I've used and I use it just about every day. So um, it's definitely a good bang for your buck. It is something that you'll be able to utilize every day and not run out of instantly. That's the worst when it comes to products when you're like, okay, I'm about to spend $140 on a product and it's going to last me six weeks. But this I could guarantee probably will last an entire year for me. Um, so love it. Smells so good. Um, I love putting it on and then um, I get little kisses on my cheek and and it smells good and he likes it. So it works. <laughs> Anyways, next up, I really like having a um, nice hand wash and then a nice body cream. Um, for me, you know, I'm not somebody who likes to wash my hands and then just like walk out of the bathroom. It's really frustrating because then my hands get dry and like then they get clammy and then they get dry again and then it's just a disaster and with the amount of times that we're washing our hands especially with coronavirus I think that um, a nice little body wash or a hand wash and then a body cream or a hand cream to go together is a perfect little combo so I had mentioned last week that I use this body cream from Milk and Honey, this is the number eight. It's the lavender and eucalyptus scent. I love this. And I was mentioning how I had um, another bottle that was used up. And instead of me buying like a new cute little hand soap dispenser from Target, I used this instead. And then I have another bottle of this. And so they're right next to each other. I just took the um, label off of the one in the bathroom, the hand wash now. So it's just like a nice little amber glass. And then I've got this one right next to it. And so people are able to wash their hands and then use this body cream um, or hand cream. I mean, your hands, they're on your body. So uh, I think body creams are maybe a little bit thicker, uh, which is perfect for me, especially in the summer when it is hot and um, super dry outside. I live in Colorado, so it is a much drier climate. And I love using this. So I actually really like that it says, like a tall glass of water, this lux luxurious, rich cream delivers deep hydration without an oily finish. And so I work from home. I am able to, you know, go to the bathroom, wash my hands right before I'm about to eat or right before I'm about to go back to a meeting and then add this. And um, if you are a skincare junkie, you know that like there's like the skincare, like I call it the skincare shine and it'll get on my computer. It'll get on my phone, my AirPods, anything that I touch. And this prevents <laughs> that from happening. So this absorbs right into my skin super quickly. So I don't actually have to deal with like having to wipe my computer off or having to wipe my phone off whenever I use body um, or like my hand wash and um, hand lotion. And so I love using this. Um, they've got different scents as well. Uh, this is just my personal favorite, the number eight. I think that the lavender and the eucalyptus together are really nice. It's invigorating with the eucalyptus, but then it's also kind of relaxing and soothing with the lavender. So a perfect combo here. And usually this is $36, but with the live stream deal, it is $30.60. And um, last week, my live stream was all about 
reusing and how to be sustainable when it comes to somebody who loves skincare and self-care and fashion and everything. Um, and so being able to purchase this and then know that I can actually use this bottle forever um, is kind of a, an incredible thing. So uh, definitely think of different ways that you can reuse the product. golden retriever and one is a great Pyrenees and together they weigh um, about 185 pounds. So um, I am always, you know, getting hair off of my bed, getting hair off of the ground, vacuuming, cleaning, and um, and it, it'll be, they love their river dogs. So they go to, into the river all the time and then they get wet and we go inside and it's smelly. And so I've been loving using this home spray and I use it in everywhere in the home. So I'll sometimes spray it in my closet, sometimes spray it um, on my bed and especially in the bathroom. I usually leave it in the bathroom. I've got two different ones and um, the home spray, you can kind of use it right after you go to the bathroom or right after, you know, if somebody, if you've got guests coming over and you don't have time to really like set a, light a candle and let it, you know, start smelling good. This is a great, great option. And so this is, um, you can do it on linens, furnishings, and in rooms just in general. And um, it is a nice blend of bergamot, thyme, eucalyptus, lavender, and Lang Lang. And so it is just an incredible scent. It's very um, earthy and very, uh, I would, I would say it's a little musky. And so it's a great scent to be able to use year round, um, but it's nothing too florally. So like your husband or your boyfriend, um, your significant other, they won't necessarily be like, oh, this smells too much like a, you know, those birthday cake candles, or it doesn't smell too much like anything intense. Um, I sprayed it for my boyfriend and I asked him if he liked it and he was like, yeah, this smells really good. And then he's like, can you wear it as like a perfume? I'm like, mm, maybe not. Maybe I'll stick to perfume for my perfume and <laughs> home spray for my home spray. But love using this. Um, definitely a great option for people who just want to have um, a nice little scent that is kind of surrounding their entire house. And so people can walk in, you know, we all have that friend that, um, that you walk in and you're like, oh, that is a distinct smell that they have in their house. And it's always like a candle or a spray that they use. And so um, I'm glad that this is my little signature spray for our house. Um, and I will have this in, usually I'll put it like right next to the toilet, maybe on top of the toilet if I've got like a nice little flat lay going on there um, with like a little cute book and then this right on top. So love using this. <clears throat> and then if you're not really a home spray kind of person, I love using candles. And so um, I've got two different options for you here today. First one is the Milk and Honey Essential Oil Candle. And um, again, I said that the number eight is my favorite. So I love using the lavender and eucalyptus candle, the lavender and eucalyptus body wash, body oil, body lotion, body scrub, milk bath, everything. All of the number eights from um, Milk and Honey are just some staples that I will never get rid of. And this candle is a great option to have just in your bathroom. It's small enough to really be able to just bring into your bathroom, leave it there. Um, you can have multiples. This is one that I always bring into the bathtub with me. So I'll light it and then I'll just put it right in the corner because sometimes there are candles that are a little too big for like your bathtub to be able to fit it in. But this is like a perfect size and it, it kind of, it's still a illuminates and it's you're able to have enough 
light in there. Um, and it's just, it's a nice little ambiance that you're able to create. So I love using this. Um, I also, uh, I think that this is the smaller version, but there is a larger version that you can get. And usually it's $62, the larger version. And with the live stream deal, it's $52 and 70 cents. And I burnt it. I mean, I've probably taken 12 baths with this <laughs> and my baths probably last like a good hour or so. So I've used about 12 hours of, of, um, of burn time and this is it. That's all that it is. It's only gone down to about here. So highly recommend using this. I love candles that are able to last longer. I hate, um, you know, when you buy a candle and then like, I don't know, five hours later, it's halfway gone and you're just like, I just spent like $70 on this candle and it's not even lasting me a week. So for all the candle lovers, this is a great, great option. Have you ever smelled a candle and your heart kind of like does a little flutter? It's just, I think it's like a nostalgic thing where you're able to mix, have scents and then have um, like a, an item or a memory kind of linked together. And so every time I smell this, I think about bath time and I think about how I can relax and how I can read my Kindle and how I can listen to my favorite bath playlist and just kind of relax and rejuvenate. And that is the smell of relaxation and rejuvenation. My next candle that I absolutely love and that I have been using for a long time is Esker's Plantable Candle. And unfortunately, it looks like it is sold out. Um, it's usually $85, but with the live stream deal, it would be $72.25. And so you can always um, request to see when the product is going to be re, um, restocked, but this is one of my favorite candles. So this plantable candle, um, it gets its name by having the option, the ability to plant something into it once it is burnt down. So I've been burning it for a while. Um, these scents are incredible. It actually, um, I, have been using this for a little bit, but the, a really cool thing about, um, this candle is that you are able to plant, um, some basil, like little, it's like a little herb pod that they provide for you when you, um, purchase it. So it comes in this nice little box and then you've got a little soil pod and then you've got the little, um, the little seeds. And so once you're finished with burning it down and I'm like halfway there now, um, you're able to just plant this beautiful little herb garden and you're able to use the herbs. And so this is, um, another zero waste option when it comes to um, your skincare and your your bath care or your self care routines, being able to find things that um, you can have for a lifetime. This is an awesome, awesome heavy weight terracotta planter, and so um, it is something that you can use and reuse all the time. If you don't want to plant something in it and you'd rather use the soil pods um, and the plants, the little seeds for a different pot and you can use this for like, if you're an artist and you use um, a bunch of different paint brushes, you can put the paint brushes in it. Or if you're a makeup artist and use a lot of makeup brushes, you can have them all in there. I'm definitely going to be planting mine because I've been staring at the little soil pod and the little um, planter for too long. So I'm super excited to be able to use this, but um, this is an incredible gift also. I think that it's a really good option for people who um, who love self-care, who love candles, and then are able to, you know, give it another life afterwards. So definitely recommend this guy. And I usually will put that like um, next to my toilet also. So I'll have like a little candle that goes on top of like the little, the toilet hopper. Um, and I'll have that lit whenever I have guests over and it's kind of just like a nice little, a nice smelling environment for sure. Um, but then I also will light that like during work uh, while I'm working at this little desk right over here I'll sit there and have that candle lit and kind of have a nice little playlist typically it's like Nora Jones it's either Nora Jones or it's like like Doja Cat like depends on how much I need to get 
done in a day, but I love being able to kind of create that environment for the bathroom, for my home in, in general. Um, so next up is another really good sustainable option. And we all are people who, you know, we've, we paint our nails, we use toner, we use, um, we use little essences or we have makeup remover wipes or all of these different things. And this is a really great option for people who use cotton pads all the time. So this is a reusable cotton round and it comes in the cutest little wooden little holder and it comes with 10 and then it also has a little um, like a little bag that you're able to wash all of the cotton rounds in. So whenever I, um, you know, want to use my toner or I'll have like a nice little day doing a facial and then I will go ahead and um, use these and I don't really wear too much makeup. So I never really need to use it as a makeup remover, but I'll use it as like a toner. I'll, I love the Ordinary's Glycolic um, Serum and I'll put it on here and I'll, you know, rub it all around around and look at how big this is by the way usually we get like those little cotton rounds from walmart and they're like this big and <laughs> they rip and they're like always kind of tearing and getting everywhere and then you have to like wipe your face off with something else because then there's like little cotton round little cotton everywhere on your face but this is made of organic cotton and um and it's like three or four layers and so it feels super soft and it's really absorbent and you're able to wipe your face use it front and back and then i usually will before i wash them i'll sometimes maybe treat it by like if i used say nail polish remover like I can use nail polish remover with this and then I'll put it in the nail polish remover to get all the nail polish remover off <laughs> or the all the nail polish off and then I'll wash it and it comes out good as new. Like these are, I've washed these multiple times already and they're all great. And so um, I don't ever have to worry about, you know, like if it's going to get stained or anything that might be a little different with like mascara or eyeliner because I don't really wear it. But if I'm able to get nail polish, off of this i'm pretty sure you can get nail polish if i can get nail polish off you can get like all of your makeup off and your lipstick and everything so um i am very confident in the abilities of this product right here and it's super aesthetic i usually would have to like keep the little plastic bag underneath my drawer or in my drawers um but this is just right next to my toothbrush and my toothpaste um my cute little quip toothbrush let me know if anybody else uses quip i love quip um but this has been a huge staple in my bathroom, just being able to have it right next to my um, little sink and, and right next to my cute little flat lay of all of my products that I use every day. Uh, it's, it's just a no brainer. And it's something that you buy once for $25 and, or with the live stream deal only $21 and 25 cents. And um, you're able to just use it every day and wash them, reuse them. Um, I haven't had to, you know, buy them again. I bought some for my sister also as a gift. Um, some different ones though, a couple of years ago and she still uses them every single day. And uh, it's just an amazing option to, especially if you're wanting to kind of make some changes um, in your lifestyle and your consumer habits. Um, so highly recommend. And then it looks like, I think we've got one more item. So. This item is a huge staple for me. This right here is the Discovery Bath and Shower Oil Collection. So this is usually $60, but it is $51 with the live stream deal. And this is from Aromatherapy Associates. And we've got the most beautiful, oh my gosh, I just opened it and it smells so good. The most beautiful collection of bath oils and shower oils. So about these products is you're able to um, put them into the shower with you if you'd like, or you can put them in the bath. So how we use it at, in the shower would be um, you dip, you put a little bit, here, I'll do it right here. We'll use... Let's see, de-stress mind. So you can fill the cap with some oil 
and then you pour it in your hand and you rub it like this and then you oh my gosh it smells so good <laughs> you breathe it in and then you'll rub it on to your chest just like this and you can do it on your neck and then as you get in the shower and as it steams up you are basically <laughs> a shower bomb or a bath bomb. And so all of this um, kind of, it helps with de-stressing. All of them have different, different benefits. So we've got the deep relax and the light relax. And then that was the de-stress mind. This one is the de-stress muscle. So if you work out a lot and you need a nice little relaxing moment, this is a perfect option for you. And then we've got um, the revive morning and the revive evening. So if you're a morning showerer, you can use this revive morning and it's a perfect option that will help you kind of wake up in the morning. You know, we used to use like um, the body washes that have peppermint in it to like invigorate your body and get you woke up or the shampoo that had um, peppermint or eucalyptus or any of those kind of invigorating oils in it. So that's kind of the same idea. And then um, we've also got the support breathe. So this is really good if you've got allergies or if you've got respiratory issues. Um, this is a good option to be able to kind of drop into your shower. I remember growing up, my mom would always put like um, the eucalyptus oil in the shower and it would help me breathe whenever I had like a terrible cold. So thanks mom for that. And then um, the, let's see, this one is the support, the lavender and peppermint and um, the support equilibrium. So I wonder actually what is in the equilibrium? Let's see. I wonder if they've got it right here. And then we've got one more, which is the inner strength. And the equilibrium is good for, oh, for hormonal needs that need to be um, rebalanced. So that is a super cool option. I think essential oils are incredible. Um, I love being able to use them and um, really see that they're beneficial. I love being able to take products that or take things from the earth that are truly beneficial. I mean, we're not the first ones to use essential oils. Um, I mean, I think that this has been around for so long and we're able to modernize it in special ways, but um, they really are beneficial and helpful to our bodies. And um, I love being able to kind of use products that come naturally from the world. Um, and then that is it for all of my staples, but I'll go over them one more time real quick for you guys. And as you know, you can find all of the products in um, those little four squares to the right of your screen. But we started off with the Surcell Nancy's Blend Extraordinary Face Oil. I love using this. It's um, a very luxurious experience. I sometimes will use it with um, an oil cleanser and then I'll use, um, I'll kind of wipe it off, you know, wash my face and then I'll put this on. Makes my face super oily um, and in a good way, in a good way, in a moisturized way. And then I'll take it and um, use a gua sha or use a cold uh, roller or even the little Solar Wave um, red light therapy. So I love using this. It is super cool because it is all about botanicals but all about science at the same time so they really do a great job of mixing science and nature together and then next up would be the home spray i love using this home spray from the laundress it's really great for linens furnishings rooms i love using it in my bathroom i leave it in my bathroom and so whenever it needs a little refresh i just spray a couple sprays it's got eucalyptus bergamot thyme lavender and lang lang in here so this is a great great option um, I also love if you're not really a sprayer uh, and a candle, you're a candle person. I love using this candle. This is from Milk and Honey, and this is the number eight, my favorite scent. Um, and I've got the body lotion as well, or the body cream in number eight. And so you kind of have like a nice little duo right here. I'll leave this on my um, right next to my sink, and I'll use this after I wash my hands, especially um, after washing your hands 
you know, we've been washing them a lot for, uh, to protect ourselves from, you know, all these viruses that are going around. And so be sure to moisturize your hands as well. Um, so I love this little combo right here. And then if you like candles, Still, I love using Esker's Plantable Candle. Um, it's currently out of stock, it looks like, but definitely send a um, subscribe for those little reminders to be able to get this. I love this candle. Uh, this was a gift that I got for um, for all of my family members, all of my lady family members, my sister, my cousins, my mom um, for Christmas last year. So I love using this. And then the reusable cotton grounds. This is a huge staple, something that you can use to um, continue making sustainable choices. You can rewash these multiple times. This is exactly what it looks like after I just washed it recently. And um, here I'll show you another one. I love, love, love using these. So that is it today for all of my staples. I hope you guys enjoyed. And um, I will be back as usual on Friday at 11 p.m. 11 a.m. Pacific time, 12 mountain time. That's where I am. And um, I hope you guys have a great weekend and that you enjoy, um, that you stay safe and relax a little bit. Take all these tips and, and get in the bathtub. Enjoy your little sanctuary that you've created. I will talk to you all super soon. Thank you so much for joining me.